Hello and welcome to another short Windows 10 tutorial. This time I will show you how to change the language settings in Windows 10. This can be useful if you bought a laptop or PC from or in a different country, or perhaps you want to learn a new language. We start by searching for the settings menu in the Windows search bar. Click on it. This opens a new window with a lot of options. In our case, we need time and language settings. Make sure that the language tab is selected in the left sidebar. So depending on the installation type or in which country you bought your PC, you might have multiple languages pre-installed. To check if the language that I want is present, I'll click on the drop down arrow. The language that I want for my Windows 10 installation isn't present. I already have the Dutch language pre-installed for the Netherlands, but I want to add the Dutch language back for Belgium. To add it, I will click on the plus sign, add a preferred language. Search for the one that you want to add in the search bar. Click next once you made your choice. Check the set as my display language box if you want to change to the selected language. If you do not check it, you can change it later, but this lets you use the keyboard settings from your new language without changing the display language. If you want, you can install the text to speech feature as well if this is available for your choice. Click on install to continue. The installation is quick to complete. Changes take place after signing back in into your PC. So I'll continue this video in a short bit. I'm back and as you can see, my language changed to Dutch. Furthermore, my keyboard settings have been set on Belgian period, which is an Azerty setting. This doesn't work all that well for my QWERTY keyboard, but I can change it in the bottom right corner by clicking on my newly selected language and select the proper keyboard settings. This concludes our tutorial to change the language settings in Windows 10. Let me know if you have any questions or comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.